Okay, I'm going to show you why it's important to use Kai, right? I tell people, don't have a Kark team without Kai. They always think, no, oh, you got to have a meta Kark team. You got to have uh, Martha in the back and, and Jorgen and Faceless or whatever. Yeah, they good heroes, you know. But what if Kark, uh, Kark dies? Then what? Who's left to kill the people? Nobody. Right? So I'm going to show you uh, the reason why. Right? Let's see. Ace High. You see this here. And you see his team is almost 100k stronger. The second team. But it lost. Right? And you know why it lost? Because Kark died, right? Once he died, there's no one else left to kill the team. See there. Here we go. Watch this. Celeste is going to stop him from regenerating. You know, and you're going to see on my video, she does the same thing. Okay, see? The Celeste stops you from regenerating. Normally, what happens if you do regenerate, you instantly do ultimate right after that, right? But in this case, he couldn't regenerate because Celeste stopped him, and that was it for his team. He has no other damage dealers on his team. So this is me down here. Okay, you see the bottom team, right? Now, it has a Celeste on there also. You know, normally I like to put Celeste, when I see Celeste on the other team, I put Celeste on my team also. I would normally take out Faceless, but I just left him in there because I know I have Kai, just in case Kark doesn't get regenerated because it's a 50-50 chance. If Celeste is in light form, He'll get regenerated. If he's if she's in dark form, he won't get regenerated. But look at this here. You see all the damage Kai did? Kark dead already. He's already dead. Alright. But watch. seen all those little tornadoes going back and forth that's it you know 
once you've seen it, and even at the beginning, you see Kai do a little tornado. Kark gets stunned and can't move. Normally, I would have Celeste there, and Celeste would instantly take the stun off of Kark, and he would do an ultimate. But see, I didn't put Celeste on the team, right? So when Kark was stunned, then Lars, I mean, then Kai did the ultimate. And when he did the ultimate, that's what killed Lars at the beginning. Right. So with Lars dead, that was pretty much it for the twins team. Kark dies right after Lars. I think maybe a half second after Lars. Watch. I'm going to show you in slow motion one more time. Boom. They go to stun on Kark. Watch Kai speed up and do an ultimate. Kark is supposed to do an ultimate, but he's so stunned he can't do anything right now. Watch. Boom. Kark dying. Kark is about to die. Here go Kai's ultimate is on the way. Bang. That kills Lars. Kark and Lars dies pretty much at the same time. And after that point, you see Lars, I mean Kai, basically just doing a bunch of ultimates and that kills everybody. Ultimate. Ultimate, 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 that's it, all right, I tell my uh, guildmates all the time, but I'm still the only one with Kai, there's a, a bunch of car teams in our guild, but I'm the only one that has Kai in it.